Hello everyone, Time Rover here, and welcome back to another video for Foundry. This is a let's try of a yet-to-be-released game uh, called Foundry, which we took a look at in the first episode where we set up our first automated uh, factory here, producing some, what are these called again, xenoferrite Zen plates here, and then the other one, do, 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 do. We've got uh, Technum Rods right here. So that is where we're at. Now, when we last left off, if you're if you're not familiar um, or didn't catch the first episode, Foundry is a sort of a factory building, base building game, uh, first person, much in the realm of Factorio um, and Satisfactory and that kind of thing. Um, but it has not yet been released and we were kind of they were kind enough to offer us a look at it So here we go um, Didn't really do much in between episodes. All I did was put out a bigger platform so that we can try and get our our um, Research area set and good I'll Plop you down right there Now it's worth noting this thing doesn't at least it I don't think so. I, my test game, I was able to put it directly on, um, directly on the ground, unlike some of the other buildings. But for this, I just decided to go ahead and build out a platform uh, to fit it. Unfortunately, it's a little big. Probably why it, it would be okay to put it on the ground, um, because I had to actually make quite a few. Um, foundational supports for this come on i want to uh, da -da -da -da. there i just want it all on there yeah we have this like undergrown area which uh i think i'm gonna fill in with dirt um I've st i started collecting some dirt but we don't have uh enough to sort of make do with this but we can certainly like start filling it eventually so like if I would grab the dirt here and put it, um, let's put it right there on five and uh, can I get, can I crouch? If there is a crouch button, I, at least I think there is. Um, gameplay, where's the uh, key binds? There we go. I thought I saw a crouch button. Yes, left control. Okay. Um, hitting left control doesn't do anything. All right, then. <laughs> Never mind. Can I get in here to do this? Um, sort of ish. Okay, well, maybe I'll do that in between episodes. <laughs> hey, the sun's coming up. Oh, we should have been up at the top of our mountain here. Oh, let's 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 go check out the sunrise zoom and maybe we can see our factory in its glory at night do, 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 do. so we have to actually to complete the the task in the top right hand corner we're gonna have to um get some stuff together some materials so Ooh, come on get up there I'm not actually crouching am i <laughs> if i had one request it would be a third person view uh, because that is one thing, like, I, I really wish I could take a look at my factory from higher up. Uh, Satisfactory has the, um, the lookout towers, which are nice. I don't know, maybe this, this game will have something similar. Oh, come on, where's my, uh, where's my sunrise? I guess we're gonna have to go to the top of Mountain Doom here and see if, uh, we can see what's on the other side. Come on. Oh, hello. Well, we don't want to fall down there. Get up. Get up. Jump. Getting a little harder to, to get up here. There we go. All right. Hey, sunrise! Oh, wow. Um, floaty floaterson over there. Interesting. We pop out of the map. We got a giant desert over there. More technomore. Some xenoferrite. 
reservoir. What is that? Water? Vroom. Let's see. Must be. Hey, floater. It's a floaty island. Oh. All right. Whoa. Let's not fall down into the death pit. Do, 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 do. There's our factory. Screenshot. Um, actually, hey, guess what? I found. Well, it's a little odd, but we have a camera tool. Woo. So I'm gonna actually zoom up a little bit. So we we can't doesn't seem to be able to build in this, but we can certainly take a screenshot though. Let's see. There we go. Lovely. All right, let's pop back out. So if I hit um, Alt U. That's what brings up the camera here. Camera options. Uh, point of it, remove cam. There we go. Boom. There, nice. So we can actually see ourselves in our lovely robot. Now, I don't know, is there fall damage? Uh, let's not fall into a pit. Whoa. Hop, 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 hop. We're losing daylight. Do, 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 whoa. All right, let's go take a look at the research, see what we need to do. Oh. Um, we need xenoferrite plates, machinery parts, and wire kernel. Oh, wow, we don't have very many plates, do we? Uh, give me all of those. And we have a ton of those. Let's, um, let's come in here, put those in, and what do we need... Or machinery parts. Just more plates. Okay, well, we might need to set up a second one of these, a second mining situation. Can we actually get that? No. Can we make anything else while those things are real? Okay, the wire coil, I think, requires, yeah, the Technum rods, which we have a ton of. So let's just build a bunch of those and give me that I wish the uh, containers had the unload button or the load button that would be nice I've yet to find a quick hotkey for bringing in um, for bringing in the inventory Toggle bill mode, pick up from belt. Like if I would do an E, if I would click E with that. No, control E, shift E, no. Clicking on it just brings up the inventory. Right clicking doesn't do anything. Celebrate point wave, those are just emotes. Yeah, hmm. Guess it hasn't been implemented yet, so I'll let that go. But yeah, we definitely need more miners so let's go ahead and build that whoa um do i want to build it over here you know maybe we could build it over here let's put in a few bits of dirt like right there might want to trim this back Put those down here. And give me one of these. And I think, to, I'm just going to connect this up with this. Then that should now get power from that generator over there. Okay, so that's good. Let's get, um, did I build one of these? New. No. Okay, so we're gonna grab you. Now, am I gonna have enough room over here? Yeah, that's gonna be plenty. Excellent. 
So you're just going to go there into there, and that should put on that belt. Lovely. Just what we want to do. How's the fuel over here? Let's go ahead and top that off. And come over here. Throw that in. Alright, so wire coil's done. Now we just need the machinery parts. So give me all of these. And I want... All the machine parts you can give me. Because this will allow us to get the... Um, Oh, the next stuff that we're looking for. Power and whatnot. And it's sort of like clear away all this. Because we're going to more or less replace it with um, foundation. Let's go see. Maybe we've built enough. Boom. Finished construction. Whoa. High voltage energy and a science pack. Hooray. Um, research interface. So there does seem to be quite a bit of research um, in the game, which is nice. I do want a battery, though. So, yeah, our task right now is to finish a battery. And now we just need to make research science. So we're going to need lots of material. Because I think it's going to take 30, if that, if, if I'm right about that. Drop all that in there. If I have any of that. Do you have stone? I, I should probably clear out some of this inventory. Wow, we are now... Are we... What's going on here? Ah, now we're just... We're saturating the line, which is fine. I am more than fine with that. Alright, let's build more of those. And I guess we can go back to clearing out this area. While we're building those, because there's not much to do. We need 30 research science to continue on with, um, to finish that task to, to get batteries. And then we can start our power, which I think I'm going to put in this area that I'm clearing. And yeah, we're going to need quite a bit of space to, uh, to do this, so. I can take this dirt that I'm clearing out right now and just move it down there to sort of expand this flooring. Um, again, I wish the, the controls were correct. <laughs> um, hopefully I'm just not like missing something, which probably am. All right. Chances are I'm not going to be able to get in here fully. I just run at this and crouch. Does it do anything? No. What if I'm not in build mode? Will it crouch? No. Okay. Then I am confused. <laughs> That's fine. I should go check on the um, the mine over there. Make sure it's fueled and ready. Are you, are you going to collapse? No? Okay. Fair enough. Uh, give me all of those. We have, uh, oh yeah, we have a ton of rods here. How many packs do we have? Still so far away. Definitely seems like, um, it's a little slower in this initial phase here. Although, I will say, I feel like my solo game went a lot quicker in terms of getting these science things up. But that's alright. We have... Things to do. Um, let's run over, while I'm thinking of it, let's run over here to our mine. And I'm, I'm completely going to forget all these things here. Let's drop some more in there. What are you mining again? What is this? Is 
xenoferrite ore. Yeah, I took out our waypoints. Um, do, oh no, this is technomore. Right. Technomore. Yeah, I took out the waypoints to take a screenshot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I didn't want them on there. There's probably a hide HUD. There may be a hide HUD. I haven't looked. I haven't uh, searched for it yet. But um, do I want to put another mine? Well, no, because we are we're saturating. We're not saturating it, but we have an over overabundance of these rods, so I'm not too uh, too worried about it. All right, we're halfway there. Let's get all this up so that we can start putting down this stuff at some point. Here, can I just start here? It's not going to let me. I would need exactly the amount I would need to get it exact, which I'm not going to try to figure out at the moment. If I could get the crouch to work, that would be uh, ideal. We'll see how that works. Mm -hmm. All right, come back up here, bring in some more of those. I'm wondering what... I mean, I could... I guess I can't smelt, can I? 66. Getting there. Over in there, and then over here. How much? My gosh, we have so much still to go. I might, I might just do the outside. And you're like, uh, it's, it's awful. Can't tell. I mean, who's, who's going to know? Honestly. Do, do, do. Some light to fit. Yeah, that's not going to, that's not going to work. Fortunately. Okay. Almost. Ba -ba. Wonder if um, grass would grow on here after a while. Like as we tear up the dirt here, you can see the grass is <clears throat> no longer on top, which definitely makes sense. But I wonder if left untreated or unmessed with. Um, if grass would eventually take root again? I don't know. Okay. I'll back up here. Oh, 90. Should be good to go after that. And then it's just a matter of uh, building our platform. <laughs> Which is going to require a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. Can we build any? We can, so let's go ahead and do that. That's... More of those. Boy, the uh, the science builds really slowly. 
other things do we actually have access to? So we do have the, the solar panels and everything. We just don't have the battery tech to, to really do much with it. Um, to store the power for nighttime. So I'm just rather than setting all that up, I'm just going to keep it going for now. Um, well, it is now nighttime, so <laughs> we're not going to be out of the woods yet with power until day comes. So uh, let's pop out our light. run over here. That might be enough. Um, hooray! We don't have any more research. What are we researching now? Let's pop back up here. So, we've got the battery tech. Um... Door, conveyor belt, balancer. Might be something. We have the container. I don't know. That's just a larger container, but it can't be automated. So that would just be for our storage. Research Lab 2. It's over here. Signs, high energy voltage, combustion generator. I don't know. I, I'm liking the combustion generator. Can we do... No. No, we need the um, research stuff. Uh, so I guess we could pick some of the stuff over here. What's this energy cell? I guess maybe combustion would be ideal. Get some lights. All right, let's uh, let's just start back down the path if we can. What do you need? Oh, you need research lab too. Oh boy. Okay. I mean, we could go down that route and just start researching this, but honestly, I'd ra rather just get something that we can use right now. Um, you know what? Let's get the conveyor boat balancer. That's always a good thing to get in these games. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, so we've got a ways to go, but I'm, I'm not going to worry too much about building those. Um, I'm rather going to try and build out this platform so that we can get our power up and running on solar. It is going to take quite a bit of uh, resources here. Give me these. Build more of those. I don't know if I'm going to go the full length right now, but I am going to get uh, at least this area done. Not, I won't say done done, but workable. Are you no longer producing? No, you are. These are as well. I guess I could connect these and um, I think I'm going to grab that and just move it over here. Not that it's necessarily needed, that one generator is running just fine, but that way it will be easier for me to load those with uh, new new stuff. Um, we need more resources, always some of those. Uh, I still have quite a few rods, so I'm not too concerned about that. Uh, 
Come on. There we go. Alright, I think we're going to be good for now. So let's switch gears to making um, the things we need for our. So the batteries, or sorry, the transformers basically replace the generators. So the transformers need to be on the blocks, the foundation of the equipment that you want to power. Uh, so we're going to make sure to basically put, we're going to need one on here and then we're going to have to hike one over to the Technomore with some power lines. So let's go and grab all that. Um, I'm going to grab, I'm just going to make all of, let's get one battery and build the solar panels then. And then uh, we're gonna need uh, we're gonna need a lot more polar power polar panels, <laughs> power poles than that. So we're gonna have to just keep bringing in more of these. Now we got more of this. I'm gonna actually see if I can. Span that that way. Excellent. All right. Um, give me the solar panels. Do that. Like I said, it's still nighttime, so it doesn't really matter if these aren't these aren't going to be charging anyway. Um, where's our battery? Uh, I'm going to put you over here for now. And then, yeah, we're going to need lots of power poles. Well, I don't know. Not lots. I mean, they go pretty far. If we look, that's 103 meters away. We're going to need some transformers, though. Um, how long do they go for? 16 meters. So we would need roughly six, seven. Somewhere around there. Six or seven poles, which how many do we have? We have six, so we need at least one more, I think. Um, I'm just going to build them all way we have overkill. Um, and then we are going to need a transformer for this platform and then one for over there. So I guess we can set up this one's platform. I think it was, what, 10? Okay, so let's pop over here. Give me, I want um, that. I want this. And I think I'm gonna throw this right here. We might move that because I think they have to connect. So we might have to move that. But for right now, that's gonna have to be okay. All right, so you're not going to work. Put you there. Um, power line. Um, yeah, you can go there. Right. Um, I think it would make more sense 
set them up this way with a power pole right here. Okay. Not sure how many power poles or how much uh, I can connect to one, but it might be four. Yeah, too many already. So I think the better thing to do would be um, drop down one here to connect to that. And then put another one right there to connect there and then cross over. Wait, what? Uh, that's odd. And it actually doesn't seem to be an issue. I guess maybe it is just it was blocked. Interesting. All right. Well, let's uh, let's plop you over here. Connect there and there. So the sun's coming up, so we should start seeing some power. Alright, we'll keep this going. Do not know how many... I have. <laughs> Alright, but that should be enough. Um, we may not even need this second pull, so let's just uh, give it a go here. Give me one of my transformers. I only have one? Okay. Thought I had more than that. Um, I need some of this. I might have to cannibalize here. Pick that up. And then... No grid, but if we do that, nope, we need the extra. There. All right, so that's going, that's going, but we don't have power yet. It's because of the sun, I'd imagine. So let's run back over here. Again, this is stuff we have abundance of, so I'm not too concerned if it doesn't run for a little bit. Um, wait, what? Oh, Alright. We gotta move them forward. There. Up there. Alright, now we are producing power. Grid stats. Oh, so, we are producing 425 and rising kilowatt hours. Which I guess is good. Low voltage grid. Okay, so we can see that drone is working. Yeah, 
Yeah, see, this is all on the run. So this is our um, our blue ore over there. So that is working just fine. And we do have a surplus of power, so that is good. Where does it show how much we're actually using? Our consumers, 200. So, I mean, we have plenty of power as of right now. Are you still running? No. You're not running, but I wonder if we should keep one of these up. In the off chance, you know, that we don't store enough for the for nighttime. If I would create another solar panel, give me a few of those. We need to put have space right here. Um, <laughs> move that. And I want this to be here. Too far. All right. And then can I get you? Ah, so yeah, that there is a max. Fair enough. Um, To, let's change around this. Um, how do I do that? Connect. Hold. Okay. Disconnect. Connect. So you're going to get that. You're going to get that. Something like that. All good? Yes. Perfect. So we have power, folks. Hooray. Hooray, hooray. All right. Well, I think we've gone on long enough in this episode. Um, we went ahead and set up our first research center, which is massive. And we've got power now, which is uh, good. Renewable power this early in the game. How about that? Now, it's not stupendously uh, space efficient and uh, and whatnot, but it is uh, it is functional. So I think we're going to go ahead and run up. Well, I guess we don't have to. I, I could just go back in and do this. Do, 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 do. Um, default camera. Uh, can I go up? Maybe? No, um, is there a way to, oh, there we go, Woo. come on, further, 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 oh, we can save positions, well, that's good.
Oh, we are going high. Maybe you did it a little bit too much. Possibly. Stop. Stop. Um. There. Halt. All right. Well, there we go. There's our base. Very far away. Come on. Let's zoom over here. Good stuff. And then we can also uh, save this position. So if I would go Alt U and say uh, Bird's Eye, save camera, boom. You do that. And in theory, if I Alt U and say uh, Remove Cam and Load, woohoo! There we go. So nice. All right. Well, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. If you are, please hit that like button. And if you want to see more content, as always, I strongly encourage you to subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, we'll see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.